Hello， 大家好，我是 Coca。今天我们请到演播室的嘉宾呢是福克斯超自然悬疑剧《断头谷》当中邪恶的无头骑士的扮演者 Neil Jackson。我们一起来看看这一位嗜血的骑士的庐山真面目。Hello， Hello， welcome, welcome. thank you. It's so great to see you. Thank you.、Um, with your head. With my head. Yeah,、oh. I know. I know. Yeah. So how did you? How did they make your head disappear in this? They、show? don't make my head disappear, thankfully. The、um, the headless horseman is played by this huge six foot four stunt guy,、uh-huh. um, and、um, they just put a green screen hood on him. So they just remove it in post,、oh. uh, green screen hood. But my character, I'm、um, I'm kind of it's the backstory of who the headless horseman was. So before he loses his head, he sells his soul to the devil, and and then he loses his head in a, in a fight. And then season two, they've done a really fun thing with witchcraft. Where we both get to share the screen a little bit.、Oh, so、nice. whenever he's nasty and evil, it's headless and it's played by the stunt guy.、Mm-hmm. Whenever it's、um, the guy that's talking and machinating, it's me. That's you. Okay.、Yeah. So I wonder how the audition was like.、Um, it wasn't actually an audition. I, I'd worked with Mark Goffman, who、um, is the showrunner of the show. Before I worked with him on White Collar,、oh, nice. I did an episode of White Collar where I had to sword fight and fight Matt、uh, Bomer, and they needed a guy who. Fight.、Mm-hmm. So when this episode came along last season, they needed a guy who could sword fight and fight with Ichabod Crane. So、uh, Mark Goffman called up and asked me if I was available, and I was. And I thought it was just one-off、yeah. um, thing. And then they called me up in February and said we'd love to bring you back for the whole of season two. So that's really amazing. Yeah, it's expanded. It was really nice. Yeah. So I wonder, like, if it is really challenging to express everything through this character, because you know it's headless. Well, the the fun thing with season two, not to give too much away. Headless and Abraham,、uh, which is the character I、yes. play,、mm-hmm. even though they're the same character, they're, they're separate entities. But we get to share the screen a lot.、Um, whenever、um, Abraham decides he's going off to war and becomes evil, he straps his guns on, becomes headless, and goes off and does his thing.、Mm-hmm. So we kind of share in the screen. But the fun thing is that in this season, Headless has got back Katrina, which is the woman he was engaged to, and he's. Desperately trying to woo her back to make her fall in love with him. So there's this weird two sides of the coin. Of one, there's this charming guy who's trying to win the woman and make her fall in love with him.、Mm-hmm. But the other side of him is that he's one of the horsemen of the apocalypse and he's trying to burn the world down. So there's this two sides of the character, and he doesn't know which one he's going to become at any one point. So he's a little crazy. That's very interesting. Yeah, it's really it's fun to play. Two, yeah, really fun to play both sides of the coin and kind of it just it's a little bit quirky. Okay, so are you really good at like、um, all of a sudden switching to evil? Um, you know what? I think it, Hollywood think the Brits are just evil anyway. It seems like all of the characters that tend to be the evil ones、yeah. are the Brits. So I, I I don't know if it's just the way we speak or the, our heritage or whatever it happens to be. But、mm-hmm. it seems like the moment you slow down, you kind of Pierce your eyes a little bit. Everyone thinks that it's nasty. So the, the switch isn't too difficult. I just up the English. Okay. Thank you so much. Oh,、uh, my pleasure. Thank you.